essential oil impacts on Boisea trivitata, a widespread pest in the United States, also known as the common box elder bug. Okay, so I got my essential oils in the mail, and um, this is going to be the first and the last time you're ever going to see Adam the Glider buying essential oils. Uh, here we go. The essential oils picked for this experiment were ones that were claimed to be insecticidal by a multitude of websites. Anyway, they follow as rosemary, lemongrass, lavender, peppermint, cedar, tea tree, basil, and eucalyptus. Out of the water tower again. Uh, got Austin over here. We're gonna show you how to get some bugs. Let's get a lot. Alright, so it's gonna be fairly easy. So there's a lot right here. So you just cup it like that, get it wedged into a corner. See that? It's that easy, folks. Hey guys, uh, it is November 20th and I thought my project was over because a lot of my specimens died in my windowsill. But as you can see, I've gotten a lot more specimens and this is actually easier to gather them now than when it was earlier. All I've been doing is taking a stick and rubbing it on the inside of these panels on the water tower. These little foot peg bolt things that bolted to the ground. The big ones were on the outside, the juveniles were on the inside as we know. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty much done here. Get them into the bag and voila. I'm hoping at least half of these guys wake up. I'm not sure. Uh, it has been cold the past couple days. Okay, so I've tried to make the same exact setup that I had going on in my room. Um, I put it in the upper garage this time because it is, whatever that says, about 47 degrees all the time. They should survive, but they will aggregate better. Um, I liked how they aggregated with the control versus the canola, but for the actual pheromones, I really want them to struggle in a sense, so they need to go aggregate. What you are seeing here is a no oil control. This is a piece of cardboard that is attached to the side of the container that they are simply meant to aggregate on. This was taken on my last sample day with the new specimens that I got from the water tower and they aggregated onto it perfectly with no issues whatsoever. And the control, very, very aggregated. So what we have going on here is the second control. Uh, the control for oil. So what we want to determine is if box elders are attracted to oil naturally and it, as they should be. That's what they suck out of leaves. They suck water and oils out um, because they're sucking bugs. They're true insects. Um, anyway, this is the second trial on the canola oil. It switched over. I did two trials because on the first trial my camera actually fell out because they were pushing against my camera lens and my camera fell out and there was hundreds of them all over my room Anyway, in both cases, as you can see, they are aggregating, but with, a, you know, a difference in activity. Next is the no oil control on the left, rosemary in the middle, and lemongrass on the right. There is definitely a lot of activity on rosemary, but both rosemary and lemongrass have deterrent effects against Boisea trivitata. Here we have lavender versus peppermint, both very, very effective deterrent essential oils. There's not really much to say about this except the Boisea trivitata avoid this one like the plague. In fact, both of them like the plague. This trial is between cedar and tea tree oil. And this ended up being one of the more interesting trials that I ran, given that the insects seemed to want to crawl around the cedar far more than the tea tree. And that is kind of unexpected, given that cedar tends to lower pH, has allelopathic properties. I figured it would be kind of the nastier the chemicals, but you know, they, they have activity on it. Another thing to point out is that when I put these two in, it's the first time that the box elders seem to want to go to my camera. Uh, I think they discovered the heat of the camera and the tube that they can go in and from this experiment they've actually prevented my lens from closing. I think there's a leg stuck in it. The final trials I ran were two-part. This is the second one due to application of 
the essential oils a finger versus the brush the brush i covered the entire thing anyway um this one pushed away the aggregation on the no oil control the basil is potent but on the eucalyptus they actually covered it now in the next one this is the original right here um, and they're still crawling all over the eucalyptus, still avoiding it. Both are acting as a deterrent, but the basil, they really don't like it that much at all. And the eucalyptus, they seem to love, which is interesting. We have reached the final conclusion! Anyway, uh, every single essential oil acted as a deterrent towards Boisea trivitata, the common box elder bug, a household pest. Um, I actually kind of like them after doing this experiment. They are kind of sweet um, as far as the experiment goes. Basil was my favorite. They rank as follows from most effective to least effective. Rosemary, lavender, peppermint, and basil all had none at the end of each trial cedar tea tree oil had one at the end of each trial lemongrass had two and eucalyptus had 12 at the end of its trial and that's the interesting part because eucalyptus is already used in a lot of insecticides um so it's it's a deterrent and it should have been one of the more effective and the reasons why are still unknown but that is the interesting outcome of this experiment now as far as box elders that were that wanted to explore on to the actual essential oils the daring ones um, every single one was adult except for the lemongrass the lemongrass had one juvenile on it and he stayed there for a long time but other than that they were all adults uh, that were just exploring it none of them stayed on it and that's the deterrent effect uh, they can go on it but then they do not feel comfortable being on it um, and I like the way these results have come out yeah, of course it's a small trial and I think that future trials need to be done more essential oils more trials more bugs more insects different types of insects more than Boisea trivitata the common box elder you could do wasps ants mosquitoes anything Anyway, that is the conclusion with my experiment. My personal favorite is basil as far as being a deterrent after watching many time lapses. Basil seems to just, they didn't even touch it. Um, so that's my conclusion. I hope you all enjoyed.